Oh, how are you guys doing? Very good, thank you. First of all, thanks a lot for uh, <coughs> joining us and doing this interview with it's us. Great to be here, thanks. How was your experience with the, uh, with the movie, especially starting with you, Alex? Hmm, it was something new, something different. I mean, it's something I've never really done before, uh, acting. <laughs> so it was it's crazy, and especially working with like Tom and Paul, it was great. I love both of those guys. Thanks, Alex. <laughs> I heard that you only did uh, school play before? Yeah, in sixth grade, Pirates of Penzance. Mm -hmm. Nailed it. I mean, I was uh, basically... They're still talking about it. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I was in the paper for months afterwards, so... What did you play? What role did you play? <laughs> Sammy the Sailor. Samuel. Sammy the not sa no, do not let him make fun of my amazing performance. All right. <laughs> I didn't. I thought Sammy the Sailor's no, crucial to play. No, it was Samuel, All right, and there. I was the Pirate's assistant. Uh, Captain to six. Not, no, 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 don't, don't even start. Crazy. How was the experience from you know transitioning from a school play to a full-length feature film? Uh, the transition was insane. Well, it, was, it was ten years later. <laughs> yeah. first of all. <laughs> five years later. No, yeah, no, it it's true. Alex came to us completely untested. We we he came in for the audition because he was a high school wrestler. So we started there, and then something about him was just right for the role, and we kept. Pushing him, pushing him, pushing him. And he auditioned a whole bunch of times and finally got the role. And then, uh, then he just really connected with the character. It was really cool to watch. And you did a great job at acting. Right? Yeah, thank you, man. You had some great names in your production team. Mm -hmm. How was it different from, let's say, a newcomer from a university? Right. Well, I mean, look, uh, this is my third film, and I think everyone involved on the production team, and certainly with our actors, and you know. We've all made a few movies now, so we have a little better idea of what we're doing. But ultimately, the spirit is always the same. Have fun. It's really got to feel like it's fun. Paul is an old friend of mine. Amy Ryan, old friend of mine. Bobby Cannavale, old friend of mine. Uh, you know, and you, you're making a movie. You're not curing cancer. It's, it's a privilege to be able to do it for a job. And, and we take it very seriously and we work hard, but we try to have as much fun as possible. And I think hopefully that shows up on the screen. From a director's point of view, mm -hmm. you were working with a young actor who who was actually for him, it was his first movie. How is it different from yeah. working with, let's say, Amy Ryan or Paul Giamatti? Well, ultimately, it's not that different. I mean, those guys have a little bit more of a technique. They have a craft. They've been doing it for 20, 25 years. Mm -hmm. uh, for Alex, it's new, so it's a little bit kind of building that together, how we're going to talk about it, how we're going to communicate it, how we're going to work together, and sort of giving him a foundation to start to build on as a young actor, it, it being his first real project. So can so, you say something about the process that you worked with him and, uh, you know, developing his character? Right. Uh, a lot of that is just, you know, you start in auditions and you literally just start reading through the script and taking your time and not trying to get the dialogue right. It's never about getting it right. It's really just about digging deeper, so maybe digging a little bit into the backstory of the character. Do you have any piece of advice from new up-and-coming directors who are actually in university right now? Just when you get out, go to a city where they're making movies. That could be New York, LA, it could be here in Austin, great film community. Just get experience, start from the bottom, get it, become a PA on a set and learn everything and do and work very hard. No matter what your job is, I don't care if you're carrying apples <laughs> or being assistant to the director, take it very seriously, work very hard. No job is too little on a film so, set. So uh, how big of a role does networking play? It's in good to industry? get in, you gotta get your foot in the job. Networking ultimately means being, being smart, and working hard and, and being likable, you know, ha having an open personality, and that's the most important thing. All the other stuff, the schmoozing, save that for Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot for interviewing with me. Thanks, Tom. Ali.